All right, let's check out these shells. Medium flat rate box full of shell jewelry. Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Full time reseller. All right, let's get started. Okay, there are definitely some beautiful pieces in this lot. So we are gonna go through it together here. These items are from my, I bought it on eBay to sell on eBay, bulk buy, 344 pounds of jewelry. I paid less than $200 for all of it. And I have a bunch of unboxing videos. Um, I took everything out of the bags and have it all laid out and ready to go so that I can show you guys. Um, that one is um, abalone, I do believe. So there's some stretch bracelets, you know, but they've got shells on them. I will probably sell some of these items individually. I will probably lot up some of these items in small lots. And I might do like a larger wholesale type deal lot also. I'm not really sure yet. Um, I still have to really go through and... Um, figure all of that the details out basically the unboxing is just kind of to to see what i have you know i'm trying to get through all of the jewelry it is so much jewelry 344 pounds you guys is so much jewelry i have uh two bags of signed stuff that are like two gallon bags and it says signed and i really really want to see what's in those bags i haven't looked yet but I want to do a video on it. So I'm trying to do things as I do videos. And I will tell you, like, I really want to do those videos. So when I rub the items together, I'm checking to see if they are pearls. Um, I'm trying to remember. I recorded this video, like, gosh, a couple weeks ago. And I'm doing the voiceover right now, which is probably not a good idea for future videos. I did uh, three unboxings and I was like, you know, I'll just record them and, you know, have the TV on and then I'll do a voiceover later. And I think that I should probably just do the video and talk about each item as I hold it up because I really don't recall everything that I had. And I'm kind of just watching it with you guys right now. As I do the voiceover, I'm like, huh, I don't remember that, or, hmm, wonder what that really looks like up close. So anyhow, um, I have three videos that will be like this, but I don't think I will do it like this in the future. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe if I just would have done the voiceover, like, the same day, but my memory, um, uh, that looks like a little shark's tooth, maybe? I don't know. You guys are probably bigger jewelry experts than me. That looks like a vintage clasp. Um, I mean, there's some neat items in here. I really don't know too much about shell jewelry. I mean, I know real pearls have some value, but as far as just items that are shells, um, I don't know. So if you guys can comment below with any expertise you have on maybe items that I should be looking for when I go through this all again, um, definitely do that down in the description. I do read what you guys write. I do appreciate the time you take to, you know, give me your little tips and tricks. Um, it's greatly appreciated. So I just wanted to let you guys know that. I mean, there's some definitely some cute pieces in here. Uh, a lot of it will be bread and butter items unless there's maybe something that I don't know about. So the other items that I unboxed, um, there was a bag labeled religious items, and those were items, you know, that were crosses and, you know, rosaries and stuff like that, and I just did a video on that. So that will be either already have posted or coming soon. And then I also unboxed a bunch of pins and brooches, which um, there's some nice ones in there. This is a pretty cool piece. It's got this little flower on the end. I think I hold it up and show you guys. Yeah, it's kind of cute. I'll probably list that one separate. And I'm rubbing it to see if it's, which I can't remember now if it was gritty or not. So if it's gritty, um, you know that it's uh, pearls. And I guess the pearls are typically um, not perfect circles. Not sure what that's called. But uh, 
If you haven't checked out my gemstone, I like this. I listed this one already. Um, and I ended up, I'll come back to that, but I ended up listing it with uh, a pair of earrings and a bracelet that matched. So I made it a set and it's super, super cute. Um, they don't go together, but it made a really nice set. I saw it sitting there and I'm like, oh, this will look good with this and this. So I did list that. Um, so what I was saying is I have some unboxing videos of the gemstones I got and I have uh, Moonstone Mamas. She has a YouTube channel and what she did is she commented on one of my videos and she was helping me. And I saw that she had a YouTube channel so I asked her to come on and be a guest and I... I think we did five videos that night and we basically just unboxed all the gemstones and she kind of explained like what to look for and you know how to know if items are pearls how to know you know just different little tricks and tips so if you guys haven't seen those videos and you want to learn that's definitely a great way to learn so definitely check out moonstone mamas on youtube she has a great channel and she has a fantastic personality just a really nice person so I'm really glad that I got to to meet her. I've met so many like fantastic people from doing YouTube. Checking for pearls. <laughs> oh my goodness. I know how to test for Bakelite. I have a video on that. I don't know if it's Bakelite or Bakelite. I always say Bakelite. Um, but I do have uh, a video that teaches you how to test for Bakelite. If you guys are interested, you can go check that out. So let me know what you think in the comments. Would you rather have me talking as I pick up each piece? I tried that once and the video was like an hour and 15 minutes long. So um, I just felt like this might be quicker. But I think that's dyed abalone, but not 100% sure. It's really cute. I think that's the bracelet that I put with that necklace. Yeah, it is. And then I found a pair of earrings. It's a super cute set but it's in, um, I think it's on all three of my stores, eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. And I have links to those down in the description of the videos if you guys would like to check out my stores. Um, if you would like to make a purchase, please make sure that you uh, put in the comment, not comment, like the notes of the eBay thing. Just put Bolo Buddies or something so that I know you're a subscriber. And... Um, when you make your offer and definitely make offers. I'm not offended by offers. I'm happy to look at offers. A lot of times on Mercari and Poshmark, I price higher because I know that I can, um, I have to send price drops and that people can send offers. And the same with eBay, I have best offer on everything. So I always inflate my prices a little bit so that I have some wiggle room when people make offers. So don't be afraid to make an offer if you see something you like. And I do sell things besides jewelry. I have over 5,000 items in my eBay store. So um, feel free to take a look. The link's down below in the description of the video. I'm also um, on other uh, my Facebook group. Definitely check that out. I share bolos, items to be on the lookout for. That's the basis of my channel is, you know, items to look out for, be on the lookout for. <laughs> items you can buy low and sell high. I think that might be a vintage uh, piece right there. Checking for pearls. <laughs> I should like give the thumbs up so that I know that it's pearls or not pearls. Like thumbs up, thumbs down. Maybe I'll do that in the future. Actually, I don't think I'm going to do voiceovers on these types of videos. I think I'll just uh, be ultra focused and just try to do the video. <gasps> oh my goodness. The first videos I did, I did from my laptop. So I don't know if you guys saw any of my unboxing videos in the beginning. Did you like them like that or do you like it like this better? Any feedback is appreciated because I want people to watch and I feel like my uh, jewelry videos are not getting great views, but I feel like the people that are watching are interested in the jewelry and I've had actually made some sales, which I didn't really expect but it's been kind of a nice surprise. So I appreciate everyone who's purchased something. Um, I know a lot of you guys watch all my videos and I appreciate you guys for watching and subscribing and be sure to hit that thumbs up. That definitely helps the channel, helps bump me in the algorithm. And I just appreciate every single one of you and I thank you so much for being here. All right, if you see a treasure, comment below with like a, a timestamp so I can find it. <laughs> 
And I'm doing this on my phone, so everything is super, super small. I know it'll be much bigger when um, it's like on a laptop or even a TV. Oh, my gosh. Sometimes when people tell me they watch me on their TV, I'm like, oh, my gosh, that's got to be massive, like huge, like my head, like when I talk in the beginning of my videos. <laughs> oh, it always makes me laugh when they say I'm on their TV. All right, so lots of shells. Can you believe this? Can you guys believe the deal I got on this? 344 pounds for less than $200. If you guys want to know the exact amount and you want to watch me weigh it and see like all the different things that I got, definitely go check out that video. It is awesome. And you can also check out the video where I actually went and picked the items up. And the gal, I didn't know her. It was um, an eBay purchase. And I just asked her if she had more jewelry. And she said yes. And um, I had her list the remainder. And I bought it off of eBay. So we kept it in eBay sale. And then I met her in Pennsylvania. No, it was in Ohio. But it was very close to Pennsylvania where she lives. And we met in the parking lot of Gabriel Brothers. If you guys ever been to Gabe's, it's a discount store. And I love it. It used to be like one of my main places that I sourced back when I only sold clothing. So I was like, oh, well, maybe she can meet me there. It was a place we both knew where it was. And then I can just go shopping after we meet. So it all worked out. So I bought some stuff to resell from Gabe's. <gasps> oh, I, I actually have a Christmas tree zip up uh, sweatshirt that I need to list that I got that day. So yeah, that one's a cute piece. There's some cute stuff in here for sure. I don't know what I'm doing right there. I didn't see any like gold or silver or any um, signed pieces per se. You know, nothing. I didn't see anything high end, super high end, but definitely a nice lot. And now that I'm doing the voiceover, like I realize like, I love this little piece. I'm definitely listing that separate. It's super cute. I don't think it's, I think it's just costume jewelry, but it is super cute. It's like a little bib, pearl, like colored pearl necklace. I'm trying to like see. But yeah, stretch. There's some cool stuff in here. Definitely some cool stuff. So yeah, again, any feedback that you guys have for me, this one's a little tiger's eye. I did learn about tiger's eye from Moonstone Mamas. And Moonstone Mamas does jewelry auctions too, so you can definitely check that out on her channel. This is really cute, but I could not get it to, to lay how I wanted it to. I wanted to show you guys. I've been really wanting to uh, buy a jewelry jar from Donatella Bodolino's auctions, but I have so much jewelry, but I want to do an unboxing of one of her jewelry jars because I know she doesn't look through them and I'm like, I might find a treasure. So that may be in the future. But right now I still have a whole tote full of jewelry to go through from this bulk buy. And you guys have seen how many videos I've done. Oh my gosh, so many. I really wanted to show you guys that necklace. I spent a lot of time on that. Oh my goodness. Thank you guys so much for being here. Again, if you can hit that thumbs up, I really appreciate it. And leave me a comment down in the uh, comments section. That would be awesome. And if you check out the description of my video, I've got links to all of my selling platforms. I've got links. To, I've got link to the gal that did my trailer that you saw in the beginning. Actually, that's my intro. I have a link to her. She's amazing, does amazing work. So if you're a YouTuber and you need an intro or a trailer or an outro, she is fantastic. I highly recommend her. Her name is on YouTube is Because She Shed. So check it out. All right, here's an Instagram post. I finally sold this little gem. So it is a Peppermint Tea Castle Star Castle by Trend Masters. And it's sort of like a Polly Pocket type deal. It's got the little figures. And then this opens up into like a little tea set. And this is from, I want to say the 90s. I don't want to tell you wrong here. 1997. 
1997 and I've been waiting on the right buyer because I know that these are worth money and I sold this today for $75 plus shipping. So definitely be on the lookout for these. Even if they do not have the box, they're still valuable. You're not gonna get as much, but um, if this package would have been in mint condition, I probably wouldn't have been, would have been able to get even more. All right, go check out my Bolo Buddies YouTube channel and thanks for watching. Be sure to check out the description of the video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.